Welcome to Center of Math, Advanced Knowledge Problem of the Week. For this week's problem, we want to prove that the set of algebraic numbers is countable. So, so the set of algebraic numbers are just roots of polynomials uh, where the coefficients are integers. That's all it is. So to prove that this has countable, what we're going to do is so take an arbitrary polynomial where a n x of n, where a n is not zero, and we're going to prove all polynomials of this form, where given some n is a countable set. So, so to note these polynomials are countable, we're going to note that uh, we have a bijection between them. They're totally determined by what we choose for these coefficients. And so they're totally determined by this n plus 1 tuple that we choose in uh, z to the n plus 1, which is just the product of n plus 1 uh, sets of in integers. But it's well known that you know, the rationals are countable. The finite product of countable sets is countable. So these uh, tuples, th this n plus 1 product of, uh, of z, which is really the, the countable set, uh, these are, again, going to be countable. So given some n, the number of different polynomials uh, with uh, x to the n, a, and not equal to 0, will be a countable set. I know we also have at most n uh, roots to a n, so that corresponds to at most n, uh, n algebraic numbers for each one of these polynomials. And so that tells us, so looking at just all the algebraic numbers that are roots of polynomials of this form of some power n, uh, this will again be, be bijective with the product of, uh, or yeah, have at most the uh, enumerability of the product of n with a countable set, which is again a countable. And so the total, the number of algebraic uh, numbers corresponding to poly polynomials of degree n is countable. So. so now that we have established that for a given n, the number of uh, roots or algebraic numbers, given these coefficients or integers, will be a countable set. Now we just need to take the union of all these uh, for all the different n. So going over n greater than or equal to 1, so polynomials are of order 1, 2, 3, etc. Uh, this is a countable union of countable sets, which again will be countable because it's kind of no more than z cross z product z. And so that's it. And so now we see that the product, the, on the set of all, because we're left with a union, a countable union of countable sets. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like this video, please check out our Facebook and Twitter, and please check out centermath.org. Thank you.